got the Oklahoma opener coming up, Texas opener coming up. I'm trying to snag both of those in the next couple of weeks. As long as I keep enough snacks in the truck for old Dr. Duck, we ought to be good. Office there? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna drop you off at the front door. You go through, open that uh, warehouse door up. I'll back the boat in and we'll fix that boat so we can get back to scout. Sound like a plan? I ain't playing. I just hope we get it fixed. What are you talking about, Willis? You're a professional. Might be in a little trouble. What does that mean? That's four. That's uh. I'm pretty good at fixing air conditioning. Who told you that? Kind of soon, that's what I do for a living. Anyway, I can fix an air conditioner. That's a boat motor. How many times are you going to get this? He's going to get in here. How many times are you going to back up and go forward? I'm going to say at least five times. That's three right there. Now he's thinking about it. Oh, we might have it this time, maybe. No. Hey, you want me to do it? Yeah, come on. What do you mean do I need to do it? You to do it. Like I need a broke leg. Yeah. I only got the first time. I broke the throttle cable. Unfortunately, so when I break stuff, I always order two. So if it ever happens again, I got an extra one.
so one of us need to spend time in here and the other one need to go check the river and I know which one you want to do Be fired up if I see some green. Oh, yeah. Well, nobody's been down here this morning. Yeah. I think you're going to start seeing all that happen this evening. Yeah. Make sure you put that plug in, you know. You think we need it? Somebody marking a hole in there. There go. Yeah, well, let's go see what this looks like. Yeah, well, let's check this back in first. There's a lot back here to look at today. You, you remember up there, if you're going up, remember how it choked down and all them trees were dry? Yeah. They're all going to be wet right now. We need to go put out marks. Big oak trees here, boy. I might have been cutting on them. Yeah. Shouldn't be, that's only uh, 135 foot. 300 feet that way. 140 feet. All right, there's two, three of them in a row. You ain't gonna get. Say what? I said left. Good job. See that over here shaking his hand. Idiots. I didn't think my head that was wild. Oh, that guy's boat right there, boy. That 
Oh! Thought you saw that. Here. I don't know if we're going to be able to get through Where are you finding down there? Creek, we can get into there. You want your sandwich? You eating my sandwich? No, I'm eating mine. Time for a picnic. I want half of that one. No, you ain't getting it. That ain't right. You could take one in there with all that green stuff on. That right there makes the beard grow. What's a sandwich without pickles? Kind of like chili without beans. Good. Everything looks good, but we just ain't got no ducks. They ain't showed up to our holes yet. A little early, a little early. They start getting shot at, they'll start looking for holes like this. And that's when I'll be waiting on them. Hopefully. Stick and move, baby. Stick and move. Okay, oh, listen. Crow? Do, do, uh, yeah, you crow hunting now? I might have to. I'd be scared to eat a crow. Oh. Not looking good for the home team. So, just for the fun of it, what are your expectations and what we're about to see over here? Very high. You have high expectations? Very high. What's very high? Like 10 being the highest. 12.5. Is that expectations or? Expectations. Hopefications. That's the expectations and results. Got this cold front coming in, I'm telling you. Everything's locking up up north. There's, I'm just telling you, I don't know where else they could be. A lot of water here though, but get some new birds coming in, hopefully. So yeah, I got uh, high expectations. I'm on scale one to ten. I'm a four and a half. Four and a half? How you get four and a half out of all this? Ex low expectations, <laughs> high results. Oh lord. It's just. See, I'm high expectations, low results, you and high and results. Then get all bent when... Well, I can't help it. I was just made that way. And hunt where? At the end of the levee? It's a decent little hole over there. It's... I don't ever see ducks going down over I see them all the time. Yeah, little... Big old fat mallard. Steak of the sky mallard. Just in ones hiding in ditch from everybody shooting at Okay, option B. We can go down the river and walk into that hole we hunted last year, that little hole. It's going to have water. I walked about more than halfway and it was knee deep. So I know it's got to be holding water back there. Or option C, kind of get up and go scout tomorrow. I don't know, whatever you want to do. 
I ain't got no options. We just got here, so. I think we can get them in that hole. <laughs> Talking about the one, so we could come here and camp and walk down the levee and cut in. It's a long walk. We usually get on the boat, the river, and drive down. Oh. Yeah. yeah, I was thinking it was to our right. I don't know my map. Well, this thing shows we're going down river. Right, we need to be going up river. Because we passed it. Hey. My mind says I'm 25 and body tells me I'm 100. I always listen to my damn mind. I'm 29 all the way around. It's a small hole, so we'll put everything on the edges. You can this room right here to land. There's a slight wind. It's kind of variating from here to here, so just kind of give them more, enough room to come in and land because this is a tight, small hole. set up on that side you stay there so you back up in that brush right behind you and I'll get on the other side of that brush since you already got tough set up there tough we ain't losing no ducks today boy Kill it. Band of the year. 
Did I really? Yeah, I'm close to it. Here's your bird right here. I shot that one too. I shot first light over there. We got it on camera, I shot, right? Alright. Hey, I got proof that I shot it. I shot the first. You can have it, it's fine. I'm not arguing. We'll flip, draw straws for it. But I'm telling you, this is the bird I shot. Oh, you saying I missed it? Bring yeah, it over I here. I shot one first light. I have both on camera of him shooting at him. I'm not saying you didn't hit him. No, he hit that bird. I didn't even shoot. Oh, you talking about first light this morning? Yeah. Oh, we must have shot the exact same time. Yeah, because only how many shots did you hear? I thought I saw uh, I only heard one. Yeah, yeah I, I heard shot, one. I shot two. Wow, because he shot for sure. We shot the exact same time. Bring it over here. I thought I saw it. There you go. Billy, you, you can keep that band because that tough retrieved it. <laughs> they keep going down somewhere right in here. Yeah. Let me go look, I'll be right back. That was an impressive first flight this morning, huh? A lot of birds moving in. That hey, other hole's a lot better. Hey, they won't end that sucker. Hey, plus it's a better setup for us. The sun's gonna be behind us. It's gonna be better. Uh, we just made a move. See if this hole will work out better. Seems like the dog, uh, the duck. Want to use it a lot more. So we're gonna see. If that's the cage. Made the move, paid off. Oh, I think it's awesome. Long walk in here. We didn't get here yesterday to really scout, so we guessed on a hole. Got close to picking it right. We did call a couple in over there, but they was the two we did call in we really wanted to be over this way. Kept watching them go down over here about 70, 80 yards away from them.
sure. Good call, dog. Yeah, we went on a hunt. But, I mean, we got the wrong, we got it wrong at first, you know. We just, there's another hole about 70 yards south of us from right here. And we kept most of going down early right here. And of course, we called a couple in over there. Sometimes you just got to make a move where the ducks really, really want to be. So that's what we did this morning. So we got over here. I came over here by myself. You can see they're still working. But we came over here by myself just kind of looking while you held the hole over there. They really liked it, so we made a move. And then, of course, you know me, I set up the decoys two, two or three different ways. So it turned out to be a good morning. Me and Billy, we got our two-man limit. Uh, we, we done it by 8.30. They're still flying. So what we're going to try to do is sneak out of here. Try not to disturb them. Let them get in here and rest for the rest of the day. And then hopefully we'll come back to this area tomorrow and uh, probably see the same hole and see if we can't get back on them. You agree, Billy? Oh, yeah, baby. I'm all about it. You got a little jewelry mixed in Oh, yeah. The, uh, Billy gave him a little bonus bird, him and Tuff. Got him a little jewelry this morning. Big congratulations on that. Oh, that was a team effort right there, baby. <laughs> that duck didn't have a chance. <laughs> Yeah, what did we finish up with? We had uh, four volleys, ten ducks. Yeah. That ain't bad. Yeah, I had to hold you off that last hen yeah. right there at the last minute. Like, I'm no, glad you done. hollered limit, limit, because I was about to grab her. <laughs> I know you were. <laughs> Good help it, boy. Oh, I know you was about to pull it. Yeah, and you All even right. counted <clears throat> that's a Hey, I can count to ten, remember? That's a good duck. We get over ten, that's when I get in trouble. Oh. Were right, well, you ready to get out of here? Yeah, let's get out of here. All right. Good boy, Tom.